Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Crystal. I'm being very quiet, and I also sound extremely tired, and that's because it's currently, uh, uh, it's 4.57 in the morning. This clock said 5.07, but that's a lie because it's 10 minutes incorrect. Uh, I just learned that right quick, and my phone right here is... My phone right here says 457, and the reason why I'm up so early and recording this specifically so early is because there's a Pokemon in Dark Cave that I want to catch, but I need to get it in the morning, and I usually have a really bad habit of waking up in what this game considers to be day, and you can only get this Pokemon in the morning, and it's, I believe, a 5% chance of getting it. It's really kind of annoying to catch, so I'll meet you guys when I catch it. Oh my god. I found it. I did. Okay. I found my Teddy Ursa. And I don't want to spoil this. I really want to catch it. Like, I don't wanna I don't wanna attack and kill it. I wanna catch it full health. Uh-oh, it's gonna be one of those. Oh, shit. It's gonna be one of those really annoying bastards to catch. I kn and I knew that was gonna be a thing, so that's why I got so many damn Pokeballs. What? No! Oh. <laughs> no. No. Well, this was going to happen eventually. But I didn't expect it to happen while I was in the damn cave. Hi, took a pee. Yes. Duh. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> okay. Level 5. Growl and Charm. Okay, that didn't take as nearly as long as I thought. So, seriously, the first time I saw a Teddy, at Teddy Ursa was that last one you just saw. And that was after like 14 minutes of recording. I was getting really scared that I wasn't at the right time of day, but then I was like convinced it was like it has to be. It, it's it's in here in the morning. Yes, thank you, Teddy Ursa. Ha! <laughs> I was so nervous. Oh, it always looks honey. Its palm tastes sweet because of all the honey it's absorbed. Oh. I don't know why you'd lick its palm, but whatever. I mean, maybe it likes that kind of thing. I don't know. Uh, you can also catch a Growlithe uh, in the route between Goldenrod and the uh, and the park. I think I might do that at some point, but I've got a Quetalava. I don't think I need to worry about getting another fire type. But I'll spread again. Oh my god. What's next? Caterpie? No. <laughs> oh, should should I should I catch a Pidgey? Should I really catch Pidgey? Oh, I'm having such a dilemma right now. I don't know whether I should just catch a Pidgey or not. That didn't take long at all. Ooh, level five. That's a great level to be at. Alright, um, you, I want you to go out and mess with his, would mess with his, uh, charm. Okay, he can't drop anymore, I'll leave Teddy Urza come out and weaken him now. Uh, sand attack. No. Okay. 
I'm gonna try and catch him now. I'm sorry for all the speed up, guys. I'm so impatient because this Teddy Ursa took so long to find. I didn't know that wild Pokemon could flee like that. I thought that only roaming Pokemon would flee. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna go train. Now I'm gonna go train. And I'll be back to you guys. I'll meet you guys back in Azalea when I'm up at a more good time of day in like 12 hours or something. I don't know. Hey everyone, here I am back. It's like 11.45 now in the morning. I sound much better than I did this morning. Thank God. I also did some training off screen. I'm not going to be using that Togepi, unfortunately. Maybe I'll use him for an HM Slave, I don't know. I don't know why, I've never, unless it's Generation 4, I don't, I don't use Togepi very, I really don't use Togepi. I feel bad for saying that, I don't, I don't know why I do. But, I think I have my team ready. What I want to do is, I want to have this Pidgey, uh, just be it more temporary than anything else. I want it to be there. Uh, so I can use fly until my Dragonite can use fly and I want to have an Umbreon I know how to get an Umbreon in this game. I do I go uh, High friend high friendship. I think high friendship in the dark So I have to be training it at night and it needs to have good friendship with me and then comes the Tyranitar which of course is late game so yeah. A white apricorn. Oh shoot, there are apricorns. Forgot. Kurt's balls suck. Heh. <laughs> okay, let's let's continue. Hmm, who are you? Kenny, eh? You want me to make some balls? Sorry, but that'll have to wait. Do you know what Team Rocket? Ah, don't worry, I'll tell you anyhow. Team Rocket's an organization that used Pokemon for their duty work. They're supposed to have disbanded three years ago. Anyway, there's a well cutting off Slowpoke Tales for sale, so I'm gonna give them a lesson in pain. Hang on, Slowpoke Gold, Kurt is on his way. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, I'm, st I'm still not feeling very good. And today is actually the last day in which I can record, so I'm hoping to record a bunch of videos today. There's that lovely theme that we love ev oh so much. I'm so glad that I got my Teddy Ursa. I'm so happy that I got my Teddy Ursa. Oh, you don't need training. Oh well, I'll use Slam and then it'll die. Or not. Supersonic is even more annoying in this game than it is in other games, I think. Why I think that is, I'm not sure. Stop. Come on now, dude. Damn. 10 damage? That's just a lot. A lot. Zubat. See, I really hate you. Zubat is my least favorite Pokemon ever. Pretty much. It's pretty much my least favorite Pokemon in the whole wide world. I, I freaking hate it. Okay. I think Teddy Ursa evolves at level 30, so I really want to get him to be an Ursa Ring a ASAP. Also, I freaking love the Team Rocket battle theme in this game. In this game, it's so good. Okay, darn! I was on top when some old coot yelled at me. He started. He startled me so much that I fell down here. I think I'll vent my anger by taking it out on you. All right, Team Rocket Grunt would like to battle. Rattata. Sir? Level 9. He's so cute! Okay. Uh, Fury Swipes. You get out. My Fury Swipes will destroy you very quickly. Alright, nice. 109, and what's next? Rattata. Again? Rocket grunts at Rattata. Fight me. Uh, Fury Swipes again. The good thing is that Teddy Ursa knows Lick, which is wonderful for uh, the fourth gym, because fourth gym is Ghost, and that's always the gym I have the most trouble with. Always has been, always will be. Probably. Ah, this is not my day! True facts. 
Sure, we've been hacking the tails off Slowpoke and selling them. Everything we do is for profit. That's why. That's right. We're Team Rocket. And we'll do anything for money. Bitch. Okay, I want you guys to, like, truly be able to listen to the t to the Team Rocket glory that is their theme. So, I'll be quiet for the next one and just let you listen to the battle theme as Teddy Ursa kicks total butt. Stop taking tails? Yeah, just try and defeat all of us. Sorry about that little thing there. That was really fucking stupid. I hate it when it does that. You rotten brat. Fight me. Jesse? Is that you? Where's James? I'm, I'm really sorry that happened. I really hate when it does that. I need to find... I need to see if there's a function that helps prevent that. Alright. Quit taking slowpoke tails. If we obeyed you, Team Rocket's rep would be ruined. Rep? Your rep already was already ruined. You guys were disbanded by freaking Red, a 10-year-old kid. To be fair, I'm 10 years old and I'll disband you. Teddy Ursa, destroy. I got to start training other guys. I'm I'm I just love this Teddy Ursa way too much. Zubat, fine. I will kill it with Pidgey. Alright, Pidgey, use your Gust. Which is, for some reason, a physical attack. Critical hit. Good job. Alright. Zubat again. God, what is with Team Rocket grunts and their damn Zubat fetish? I swear to God. Oh my god, I'm so sniffly. I'm sorry, guys. It sucks. It sucks. Okay, let's just quick attack him. It'll be over quick. Excellent. Just too strong? Yes, I am too strong for you. I always have and always will be. Now, in Harkold Soul Silver, this guy would be an admin. There's only two admins in the other game. Er, in this game. There are six in the other. Si what am I saying? There are two admins in this one, and there are three admins in Harkold Soul Silver. There this guy would be admin uh, Proton, I think? Or executive. If you interrupt our work, don't expect any mercy. Mercy? Since when was I asking for mercy? Beatrix already, show Beatrix already shows me no mercy in Final Fantasy IX. I'm used to no mercy. Is that all? Cough coughing. Oh shit, you're strong. Sweet, Pidgey will have a field day taking you out. Lel, you missed. Okay. Gust attack. Do! Unfortunately, sand attack wouldn't be able to hit because I'm pretty sure it's a ground type move. Oh god, Smog. Please don't be poisoned. Okay, because I swear every time I get hit by smog in, uh, in Fire Red Leaf Green, I always get poisoned. Like, every time I get hit with smog, I usually bet on getting poisoned, and guess what? I get poisoned. Every time. This ga the game hates me. A lot. Alright. Good. You're looking nice. You should be evolving into Pidgeotto... Now? No. Yeah, Team Rocket was broken up three years ago, but we continue our activities underground. 
Now you can have fun watching us stir up trouble. Oh, get get out. Oh my god, Kurt. Your balls. Way to go. Team Rocket has taken off. My back's better too. Let's get out of here. Okay. So, I'm probably not going to be using any of his balls. They suck. And a lot of them are glitched in this game. What I mean by that is, like, they have completely different functions. So, like, I, I guess the best way to put it is that, like, the like for example, the moon ball or whatever, it's uh, what it does in, uh, in Heart, Gold, Soul, Silver, I believe, is that it increases the chances of catching Pokemon that are caught at night. But in this game, it's Pokemon that evolve through use of uh, a Moonstone. So that pretty much leaves you with the uh, very few options of Jigglypuff, Clefairy, and a couple others. Okay. I need to fight something. I do. Tell me something. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? What, you beat them? Ha, huh, quit lying. You're not joking. Then let's see how good you are. I'll fight you, and I'll win. Silver wants to fight. Alright, Ghastly. Oh, shit. Looks like I made the right decision, I think. Oh, wait, no. I thought I, thought I sent out someone else. Alright, Ember! That should kill it pretty quickly. If not, like, two, two shots. Lick? Ew. Oh shit, why didn't I send out my, uh... My Teddy Ursa? I could have killed him in one shot. Or something, probably. Of course, Ghost is obviously a special attack. Uh, let's see, what do you have now? Croconaw. Already? Where's my Mareep? I'd be able to kill it, quick! Alright, I'll use Pidgey. Sixteen. Uh, I feel really bad, because I love Croconaw, and I love Feraligator, and the fact that they're under the rule of this person makes me feel very bad for them. Scratch. Why are you using that? Ow. You should have some kind of water type attack at this point, right? Jeez. Scratch again. Ooh. I think if he does that one more time, he'll die. Or, Pidgey will die. So I'm gonna use a potion. Scratch again. How much does it really do? Ow, it does a lot. So, that like, that was almost 20 damage. I'm switching out to Teddy Ursa. Because the Fury Swipes will be able to do some pretty good damage. I'm so happy that I was able to figure out that you can catch a Teddy Ursa. Alright, Leer. Oh, that's why. I got you. I got you. That's why. Come on. Hit five times, please. Hit twice. Okay. Fury swaps again. Come on, don't die. Oh, you got a lot of defense on you, which is, per which is absolutely fantastic. Alright, what is next here on this list of Zubats? God damn it, Zubat. I hate Zubat. I hate it. I love Crobat, but I hate Zubat. Hate it with a passion that burns ferociously. Three, four times? Three times. Bite. Ow. I think Dark is a special type of move. Why the hell? Teddy Ursa, why? Please. Why are you allowed to go first this time? That is bullshit. Fuck. Why do you keep missing? Uh, ooh, super potion. I don't care, he has close to 50 HP. That's good enough for me. That's so stupid. This, like, every single Pokemon game I play except for Heart, Gold, Soul, Silver absolutely despises me with the passion. The RNG is never on my fucking side. Okay, had that hit me, I would've- WHY?! Why is that happening?! He doesn't have any evasion up on him! That's so dang stupid! And he didn't even use sand attack! Oh well, I won. Ugh! 
Huh, useless Pokemon. Listen, you only won because my Pokemon were weak. You need to shut up. I hate the weak. Pokemon trainers, it doesn't matter who or what. I'm going to be strong and wipe out the weak. That goes for Team Rocket, too. They act big in a group, but get them alone and they're weak. I hate them all. You stay out of my way. A weakling like you is only a distraction. You came up to me. What do you want, Liz? How are things going? Oh, you have to hear this. Blah, blah, blah. Nidoran is so adorable. Blah, blah, I don't give a fuck. Okay. So, oh, my God. I'm just so mad with that stupid Zubat. I'm so mad. Now for the actual reason I came over here. My actual reason for coming over here is because I want to get... I want to get the charcoal. No. You know what? Die, Caterpie. I don't even care. Dude, d Die, Metapod. Okay, talk to this guy. Oh man, my boss is gonna be steaming. The far fetch that cut trees for charcoal took off on me. I can't go for it in the Ilex Forest. It's too big and dark and scary for me. So yeah, go after it for him. I have a repel on me, so I should be able to be fine. But it is pretty annoying uh, do doing this. This is pretty annoying. You need to get it while it's back is turned. Dirt turned. Qua! It's the missing Pokemon! So yeah, you have to catch it while it's back is turned. So you have to, like, go around. It's ridiculous. And I'm speeding up this part because I really hate this part of the game. Qua! Qua! The first one's not nearly as annoying as the second one. Or wait, you have to catch it from you have to catch it from the back in um Harkold Still Silver. That's how you do it. Well, thanks a whole bunch. My bosses won't obey me because I don't have any badge. Oh! Oh, there there are two in Harkold Still Silver. But there's one in this game. I'm a far you found it first, kid. Without it, we wouldn't be able to cut trees for the charcoal. Thanks, kid. Now I can how can I thank you? I take this, HMO one. I don't need I need cut. Of course you have to have the gym badge from Azalea to use it. The Pals Effect wore off, that's fine. But that's not the real reason, I mean, that is one reason why I did this early. But the real reason I did this early was because I can go back to their place and they can give me a charcoal, which I can give to Quilava, and that'll increase his fire attack. You chased Team Rocket and went to Ilex Forest alone? That takes guts, I like that. Come train with us. I'm sorry, I got this for, cha uh, this for you. This is charcoal that I made. Fire type Pokemon will be happy to hold that. Happy? Aw, oh, I can make Kulava happy. Oh my god. Something about my nose today is like extra not good. I I'm I must be sick. It's not probably not just allergies. It's already holding a berry. Yes, I want I don't took Kulava's berry and made it hold the It makes it sound like I'm forcing I'm forcing him to hold the berry and then I'm like taking it from him forcefully. Okay. Now let's do. Yo, Challenger. Bugsy's young, but his knowledge of po- What? He? I thought it was a she! Is real. It's going to be tough without my advice. Let's see. Bug Pokemon don't like fire. Flying type moves are super effective, too. I totally thought Bugsy was a go was a girl. I don't care. I'm always gonna- Maybe they made- I think they made Bugsy a girl in Heart Gold Soul Silver. But in this game, he's a boy. Which is really weird. Hi, are you challenging the leader? No way. Excuse me. And luckily, the puzzle uh, in this, like in this gym, is not nearly as annoying as it is in Harkle Soul Silver. Huh? Oh yeah, there aren't any double battles in this game. I forgot. Double battles didn't exist until Generation Three, I think. And heck, they didn't even do, uh, they didn't even do double battles in, um, Fire Red Leaf Green unless you were actually fighting twins, which is weird to me. Lediba, I ran into one this morning, at like, four in the morning. Holy shit. Oh my god, this is- Aw, oh, damn, I thought the snow stopped. Ah, it was snow- it's, it's been snowing like hell outside. Like, maybe five minutes after shoveling the whole driveway for me. It was covered again, and I and I just I just couldn't I just couldn't take it. I, I was way too pissed off. 
All right, I want my Pidgey. I'm, I want my Pidgey to evolve ASAP. So let's do. You say the Slowpoke? Who? You're mighty, but my grown-up Pokemon are pretty tough too. Sir, I am more mighty than you ever will be. Bugcatcher Josh. At least you acknowledge my powers. Paris. It's not grown up. And besides, you're talking about a... A Pokemon that's been taken over by a Parasite. That's just terrifying. Like a zombie or something. Jesus Christ. Alright. Good job. Urg, yeah, bro. This is why people don't mess with me. Bug Pokemon evolve young, so they get stronger that much faster. What, are you gonna have a Beedrill or something? <sighs> Benny, uh, a Weedle. Oh boy, he's gonna have a Beedrill on him, isn't he? Pidgey. Gust. Do you, do you guys really want to see this? <clears throat> oh my god. You will die. 70, oh my- Look at that! He's totally full too, isn't he? He's probably got like one EXP left to earn. Gust again. Just keep spamming the move that's super effective on them. Bugsy and uh, Faulkner are extremely easy. Bugger Benny- A uh, Beedrill! Beedrill, there we go. He looks big and strong, but he's not. I mean, he is, but... Level 12. Crazy. Critical hit! Of course I got a crit. 408 experience, jeez. Just evolving isn't enough. True facts. When will you evolve? Freaking A, dude. Okay. One more chance. Buck Walker are cool and tough. I'll prove it to you. Uh, they're not... I mean, they're cool, but they're not tough. Sorry. Unless it's Genesect or something. Because I don't use... I don't use bug types. Oh, you just have the one because it's level 12? Well, goodbye. <laughs> I can't. I'm so rude. Get out of here with your Caterpie. Oh, you have two! Interesting. A Weedle. Uh, level 12, of course. And Gust will kill it in one shot. Oh my god. I'm gonna start. Oh, I have water here. I forgot. I filled my water bottle this morning before I was, rec before I was gonna record. Because I knew it was gonna be a long one. Just what the doctor ordered, too. Because I was getting really thirsty. You proved how tough you are. That's true fact, man. Ooh, evolving. Yes, give me my Pidgeotto. Congratulations, your Pidgey evolved into Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto. Okay. Finally, before we end this part, it's time to beat the crap out of Bugsy. Okay. Who am I going to use? I'm going to use Koalaba, because why not? I'm Bugsy. I'll never lose when it comes to bug Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority to on bug Pokemon. Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. Totally looks like a girl to me still. Metapod. You don't have a Butterfree? I wish you had a Butterfree. That would be amazing if you had a Butterfree. Get out of here. I really love fighting gym leaders, no matter how hard or easy they are. It's just the fact that it's a gym leader. Alright, Scyther. Damn. Scyther, wow. Okay, they, they made... They made Bugsy a lot more buffed in Hard Cold Soul Silver, I remember, because I think the Scyther is actually like level 20 ish. Or something, right? Something like that. Some some crazy high level. Like maybe it's level 19 or something. It's 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 higher than 16 though. Get out of here. 
It's worth a lot of experience, though, which is wonderful when you take it out. Your stats are looking really good, Kualava. I'm, I'm loving you right now. A Kakuna. My only wish is that they made it from Kakuna into Beedrill, and from Metapod into Butterfree for the for the gym leader. That would be way more manageable. Like, or uh, that would make it a lot more fun. There we go, another solo. Leader Bugsy was defeated. Whoa, amazing, you're an expert on Pokemon. My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win, take this badge. Can you receive the Hive badge? Ew. Do I have Hives now? Jesus. Do you know the benefits of the Hive badge? If you have it, Pokemon up to level 30 will obey even traded ones. Pokemon that will know Cut will be able to use outside of battle too. I want you to have this. TM49. Good, good. Uh, Fury Cutter. If you don't miss, it gets stronger every turn. The longer your battle goes, the better it gets. Isn't that great? I discovered it. Oh, interesting. So Bugsy discovered... Yeah. He discovered Furry Cutter. She discovered Furry Cutter. It's a girl. I don't care what anyone says. Bugsy is a girl. Bugsy is a girl, just like Lucius is, is a girl in Fire Emblem. I do not care.